Godfrey was on vacation when he decided to use his drone, hoping to find something interesting. However, he ended up discovering something that would shock the entire world. From the eighth floor of the hotel, he launched the drone into the air with a smile of excitement as the device buzzed and quickly flew away. He had been thinking about climbing mountains for some time, but before making a decision, he decided to check how dangerous the area was using the drone. With the control in his hands, he carefully watched everything the camera captured. The drone flew over people, cars, and trees, but soon the number of people started to dwindle as it approached the mountains. The device passed over green fields and mountain peaks. Satisfied, Godfrey kept pushing the drone further, convinced that when he decided to climb, he would have a great experience. As he piloted it, the drone flew over a mountain, and something strange caught his attention. He suddenly stopped the device, thinking about what he had seen. After a sigh, he decided to fly back to the spot and let the drone hover in the air, with the camera pointing downwards. From his balcony, Godfrey watched the monitor in his hands. It looked like a spot in the middle of the greenery, something that didn't make sense to him. At first, he was sure that the spot had moved. He tried zooming in, but the more he did, the blurrier the image became. Realizing he needed to get closer, he began lowering the drone slowly toward the spot. The shape grew larger, and his eyes widened in surprise as he discovered it was a black dog. The animal was lying on its side and didn't seem to be bothered by the drone flying above. Godfrey wondered how a dog had ended up so far away from people and so high up in the mountains. He couldn't imagine how the animal had gotten there. Godfrey turned the drone to explore the area, hoping to find the dog's owner, but there was no one nearby, not even for miles. He turned the camera back to the dog and brought the drone in closer. His heart raced when he realized the animal was in distress. Something terrible was happening to the dog, and it was miles away from any help. Godfrey thought for a few minutes, took a photo of the dog and the surrounding area, and then returned the drone to the hotel. Once he had it in hand, he quickly left the hotel, heading to his car, determined to save the animal that was clearly suffering. Nothing would stop him from rescuing it. With the drone in hand, Godfrey jumped into his car, revved the engine, and sped toward the mountain, kicking up a cloud of dust as he drove. He gripped the steering wheel tightly as if his life depended on it, not understanding why this dog had suddenly become so important to him. It wasn't something he typically cared about in his day-to-day -day life, let alone enough to think about rescuing an animal. Godfrey was the owner of a successful company, and for the first time in seven years, he had managed to take a vacation. Since his university days, he knew he wouldn't be happy working for others. He wasn't the type to follow orders, so he was determined to be his own boss. In his last year of university, he founded his company. Initially, it was an entirely online business, but soon the idea became a success. The reviews were excellent, and within a year, the number of users doubled. As demand grew, Godfrey had to hire his own team. He became a boss, and in no time, he expanded the business to include freelancers and occasional clients, broadening his market and the company's profits. When his company turned seven years old, he realized that he couldn't keep working so much without enjoying the fruits of his labor. Despite making a lot of money, he wasn't enjoying it at all. He decided it was time to take a break and relax. After all, he had surrounded himself with competent employees and was confident they could handle everything in his absence. He imagined he'd have an incredible vacation, with mountain climbs and even skydiving. But he had no idea he would end up driving toward an unexpected rescue. Godfrey drove through the mountain roads, not to climb, but to search for the dog he had seen with the drone. He drove as fast as possible on the dangerous roads until he stopped the car. If he went any further, the vehicle would likely break down. So, he started walking, launching the drone into the air again to locate the dog. After spotting it, Godfrey headed toward the location. As he climbed, the terrain became increasingly dangerous, and several times he almost lost his balance. He wondered how the dog had made it so far and so high in the mountains. 
When he finally arrived, his heart sank at the sight of the animal's condition. The dog whimpered in pain, and Godfrey, watching closely, noticed something surprising. The dog was pregnant. Calmly, he tried to soothe her. He reached out slowly, aware that a pregnant dog might react aggressively. However, to his surprise, the dog didn't react at all. It was then that he realized, with a knot in his chest, that the dog was also blind. Godfrey dropped to his knees, shocked by the cruelty of the situation. He couldn't believe that someone had abandoned a blind, pregnant dog in such a mountainous area. Carefully, he lifted her in his arms and began the difficult descent down the mountain. The journey back to the car was long due to the extra weight, but he eventually made it. He placed the dog in the back seat and, using GPS, found the nearest veterinary clinic. Upon arriving, he stopped in front of the clinic, ran inside, and asked for help. The dog was immediately taken to surgery. After a few hours, the vet came out with a smile, saying that if she hadn't been rescued in time, both she and the puppies wouldn't have survived. The delivery was a success, and the dog now had six healthy puppies. Godfrey wanted to see the dog, but the vet said the staff was still caring for her. While they talked, the vet revealed that he recognized the animal. The former owner had brought her to the clinic months earlier, but instead of taking care of the dog after an injury, he abandoned her. The twisted leg and blindness were consequences of neglect. To Godfrey, it was clear the owner no longer wanted the responsibility. Later, when the dog was cleaned up, Godfrey visited her. She seemed weak but visibly better, surrounded by her puppies. Surprised by her sweetness, he decided to adopt her right then and there. During his vacation, Godfrey visited the clinic every day to see Teddy and her puppies. By the end of his vacation, Teddy was discharged in good health. He made renovations at home, installing safety features so she wouldn't hurt herself, and always took her on walks, buying her treats. They became inseparable friends. No one would have imagined that a trip could create such a strong bond. Grateful for the experience, Godfrey promised never to miss an opportunity to take a vacation again, eagerly awaiting the next miracle. This is an incredible story. What would you do in Godfrey's place? Leave your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.